do it. What is going on, people of Earth? How is everybody doing today? I don't know if you guys even see me or know that I'm here yet. So I will wait for the first person to acknowledge that I'm here. See, don't just stop Franco. Uh, <laughs> hi, Bay. <laughs> I hate that word. Um, hey, Frank. Okay, there we go. Now we're back. Hill Billy Urbex, what's going on? Karen, what is going on? Jessica, uh, Joseph, and Tamara, Savandra, Canadian. Yeah. Tammy, Andreas, uh, I, Chris West. How, how, oh my God, names are flying. I can't say that much. But what is going on, everyone? I am about to embark on another crazy journey on this mystical land that we call Earth. <laughs> no, but seriously, I am. Now it's finally happening. It's becoming, slowly, getting closer to fall. And I've been dying because I love the winter season. A lot of, you too, a lot of people might hate that I say that. <laughs> Thank you, Sean. You didn't have to do that, man. Love you too, brother. Um... But yeah, that's pretty much what is going on. Uh, please be careful. I will, I will, well, I mean, where's the fun in that? No, I'm just kidding. I have to be careful. Um, oh, snap. I got the double O. When are you coming to Arkansas? I have no idea. Basically, what I'm going to do is first, um, I got this next coming up month, I, I think. I don't want to give any straight time frames just yet. Uh, but I, I'm trying to see if I could get this car to the Ford dealer, get it checked out, make sure everything's ready to rock and roll because the last thing I need to do is get trapped in the middle of nowhere. Uh, shout out to Mississippi. Shout out to Mississippi. Um, I literally almost just burped there. I had a hiccup. I'm just holding down the hiccups. Uh, love you and your videos. Thank you, Chris. I appreciate it. <laughs> You're making me blush. Dang it. Try not to. Hey, Frank, when you... Uh, uh, wanted to do uh, Linden Cemetery in Florida. I gotta stop saying, ah, oh, I sound like I have a problem. I made it, I don't know when. Basically, so this is what's going on. By Monday or Tuesday, I think it should be Monday sharp. I have a big video coming out. It's actually gonna be really good. Quality's gonna be close to perfect uh, that I could possibly say. It comes out on Monday. I'm still doing editing to it to make it good. I wanna show you guys like a sneak peek, but I don't even have the laptop with me. But if I did, I would show you at least just the intro because I always geek out on doing the intros. Um, I'm using a couple of cool stuff to really bring out the intros into it. And so I also, thanks to a friend of mine named Pete. I don't know if you guys know Pete, but Pete's a really cool friend of mine. I got an editing software that I'm going to start learning so I could also bring up the quality a lot higher than 1080. And I'm talking about like 4K. You can see everything. You can even see your mom's house uh, if you look far enough. So that's kind of some of the things that I'm, I'm, I'm trying to jump into. Uh, that's something. The other thing is, I guess, yeah, I, I make it out. I start heading towards Texas. And then Texas, I have a place that I'm trying to, I want to do a video there because the other place, um, I don't know if you guys remember, oh, there's a train going on outside. But I have another place that... Uh, Salud, Franco. Saludo. <laughs> Should uh, relax and enjoy your time, Franco. Take... Uh, oh, I missed it. I lost it. Take stride and hugs. Keep on living the... Oh, thank you, Caprino. It's some It's some dream. It, it's, it gets challenging, man. But, uh, yeah, so I'm, I should be making my way to Texas, hopefully. And then I'm trying to get to this one new area that hasn't been seen yet. I think it's a, a hospital or a mental hospital, but it hasn't been seen yet. Um, I have to talk to the lady because she, they were owning or they were maintaining the Nazareth Hospital. I don't know if you guys remember that one, but unfortunately, I lost the location. The Nazareth Hospital is now owned by the state, and God only knows what's going to happen because Texas came out with a law that you have to put sprinkler systems in it, and, and that's what made things really chaotic. But uh, yeah, I am in a location that I want to bring you guys to. It's going to be something basic keep seeing lights behind the car and I just want to make sure nobody is here because we all know I don't do well when there's other people here. Hello from Canada. I'm a big fan of your videos. Franco. Harry, thank you. I appreciate that. I'm glad you enjoy it. Shout out to you, Harry. George A. Pena Jr. 
South Texas. Well, I actually know a friend of mine that has your same exact name, George A. Pena Jr., that does workout videos. Could you be that George? Are you that George? I don't even know if you are that George. But you do like a weight loss channel, I think. Come to Waverly Hills in Kentucky. Kentucky. I would definitely like to check that out. Hi, Franco, watching from the Philippines. Philippines is that? Oh, by the way, speaking of overseas, I am planning, I guess next winter, this is my new thing. I don't want to come back to Florida for summer anymore. I think that's a thing of the past, and I want to leave it there. David, what's going on? Franco, Air 51. And the aliens, of course I'm going back to Area 51. That is actually one of my favorite locations. I might spend a couple of days in Area 51. Um, <clears throat> but yes, definitely, most definitely Area 51. That's actually one of my favorites. I'm not even going to lie. Um, but I think next fall, I'm leaving the United States. And I'm going out outside. Um, I was looking at Mexico. Every time I say Mexico, I think of Donald Trump. I don't know why. Not not trying to get politician, but I want to say it like he says it. Mexico. I don't know why that hits me, but it always gets me. Like, I want to go to Mexico. Or, no, does he do it like He's like, I want to go to Mexico. Oh, see, there is a car. No, there isn't. There is no car. So what am I seeing reflecting? Anyway, before I get, I, I lose my, my <laughs> lose my, my mind. Um, I'm, I have... I have the the intentions on wanting to go to Mexico. I might. It's a hit or miss. I don't know yet. But I'm definitely leaving. And things are going to change. Uh, God only knows what's going to happen. If you don't hear from me, I died doing what I loved. But that being said, Carmel, Maine. I, I get, man, I get, I, I think in every live stream, somebody asks me about Carmel, Maine. I looked into it. And I think it's just a, a video that someone made. I don't know too much into it. In fact, I don't know enough to even talk about it, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I want to do, I want to, I would never be able to do what you, sure you can. All it takes is just going and just doing it. I mean, you, you can't be afraid. But anyway, I don't want to get into that. Let's go for a little walk into the unknown. I got a cool little place here. You probably might recognize, you're going to recognize it. You have to recognize it. And I guess we could walk and talk. Hi, Franco from Brittany and Roger. We love your videos. Thank you, Brittany and Roger. I appreciate that. Um, I just realized it might get a little bit dark, and I am super zoomed in. You guys almost celebrated. I thought that was a, a train. <coughs> All right. The car is locked. Let me put this thing on it. Bear with me. There we go. But thank you, Brittany and Roger. Christopher Little. Thanks, brother. You guys don't have to do that. Leslie uh, Murphy. Thank you. Um, trying to see if I can just go into the front here. Scrolling up. There we go. All right. And I need a light. All right. So whoever figures this one out first, I'll give a shout out. Well, I don't even think I have a name for this place. I've had many names. I keep giving it like these code names but hey franco great job thank you i appreciate it oh i haven't well not yet wait until i leave the states that's when everything gets intense again <clears throat> my throat i want to see if i can make it into this one area here without getting any spiders there we go abuelita cemetery no but the video that I'm about to come out with is, or had has to do with the Awalita Cemetery. Uh, Christopher Little, you're welcome, big homie. <laughs> come to uh, Charlotte and see. Definitely will look into it, man. I appreciate that. Brittany Rains. Hi, Franco, Roger, and Brittany. Oh, wait. Am I reading the same ones again, or is it is it just me? Dixie Operator. Uh, love the video. Stay safe. Bro. Thanks, man. I definitely will. Um, so... Yeah, the next video that I'm going to be working on, I probably, wait, Tammy, I saw you, hey, Franco from Windsor, Ontario, Canada, oh, thank you, I, I, I know some people in Canada, Tammy, I saw you, and I don't want to miss you, I know you were there, oh, no, 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 I got to go here, 
All right. And there we go. Tammy, miss you. Tony Super. Oh, I didn't mean to miss your, uh, your super chat. It's weird. Tammy doesn't even show it. But it's okay. But, Tammy, you don't have to do that. You really don't. <laughs> I wanted to keep talking to you guys about what, what, what the plans are. Okay, so I'm leaving to Texas, and then I'm going to probably do a roundabout from Texas. I might be going close or passing the New York area. Have you been to Gettysburg, Pennsylvania? Yes, I have. Um, and so I'm going to be going to... This is the hard part when you got to have a conversation and you're hearing some weird stuff going on. Um, I'm going to, well, see, my brain is like everywhere right now. Oh my God, stupid car. I thought there was somebody here. <laughs> that actually got me nervous. But I'm actually going to, uh, trying to see if I could pass New York and get back up towards Maine. I know there's a lot of little hidden secret areas around those areas. And uh, kind of do like a couple of months around that area. I'll be moving all around the place. So, And then making my way overseas. I don't know where I'm going to just yet. But I am going somewhere. I don't know if you guys are able to recognize this place just yet. Is this the place with the black marble faced leaking tomb? No. You're talking about weeping angels. If you see a spirit, shadow, or a person sitting on the bench alone out of place tonight, um, please approach it. You see, I, I, I probably will. We'll see what happens. If I get that lucky enough, I'm not going to get... I'll approach it within 10 feet distance in case somebody has a knife. Because if somebody has a knife, they could sprint at you. This is Florida. Okay, Florida is the worst place to be doing this stuff at. Like seriously, Florida is the, look it up. Just look it up on the internet. The whole thing with the Florida man is true. But this is actually where, I had a couple of creepy things happen here. Uh, three crosses, no, this is, the, see everybody thinks this is weeping angels. This is this place, if I'm lucky that door's open. But I'll go in there right now. Maybe this will help you guys to remember. Does this look familiar? Warning, no spamming. Um, see if it does look familiar. I hope I didn't miss anybody. Love you, Franco. Oh, Molly and Emily. Love you too. Sorry I missed you. Damn it, I didn't mean to miss anyone. Okay, no, I didn't. I'm Now I'm back on track. There we go. Well, yes. Okay, see, I, I told you. Well, that didn't actually happen there. It actually happened over here. All right, hold on if I don't talk for a minute. Let's see if I can zoom in. I wonder if I could give you guys some cool filters. Hit that like button. Oh, that, that would be cool. <laughs> Thank you. Um, trying to see if I can bring this down. There we go. I don't, unless you guys want color. I don't know if you guys want color. <laughs> All right. I want to try this. What's up, Franco? What's going on, McAdams? Miriam, you should get a spirit box. I I have everything charging for my last adventure, which is coming out on Monday. So Monday, get ready to see that one. I'm excited for it. Let's zoom out. <laughs> Damn, it is super loud. This is kind of why I like to do my... If you guys ever do ghost hunting, do it late at night. Don't do it. Don't do it like I... Like in the... Like right when it gets dark, like now. Because you're going to hear a lot of cars. Oh, there's a bunny. Sorry. It was a bunny. <laughs> Hi, handsome. You must be talking about another person here. Because 3 a.m. is probably the best parent. Yes, 3 a.m. is by far the best. If you guys want color. 
Where are you going? Where are you going? Are you looking for food? All right, let's go. I'm scaring off the ghosts. <laughs> You're right. That's exactly what's going on. Um, you do stuff just to give me a heart attack like you did in Indiana. Oh, my God. Indiana almost got hit by a car. You know what I should do in Indiana? I should get out of the car. Gary, Indiana. The most dangerous place from what I'm hearing. What time is it now, Frank? Right now it is 9.56. About to be uh, 10. All right, let's go inside. Let's keep our fingers crossed here. Wait, I can I cannot see anything. There we go. Love you too, Julie. Julie, I've seen you here in a lot of times. I don't know what's changed. I actually haven't been in here in quite some time since the last time I was here. You should see if you can get here at some point. I work there and it's haunted. You sent me coordinates? That alone is creepy. Like, not, not calling you creepy. I'm just saying that's already spooky. It's like, Frank, go to these coordinates. They changed it. These chairs were in a circle last time. But, Mr. Ireland, uh, you'll probably have to message me on, on I guess, Insta. And I, when I ever can, I'll look into it. Um, there we go. No. Uh, I zoomed back in. Trying to turn it around. There we go. Oh yes, I got. I actually gave my mom my other camera. I just bought another camera, so I gave her my old one, so she could use it for her uh, for her art. My mom does a lot of good dress. She did one of my grandfather just recently, like she literally did, and uh, yeah, it's the place where the yes, this is the place where the chair moved. That chair, to be more specific, way back when, literally on the early Franco days. There's like mold. Or is that mold? I don't even know. Thing is with these mausoleums at night, you go into them and you get these bugs start jumping on you. There we go. Something I always wanted to do was just to turn off all the lights and just kind of be in here while it's quiet. Those little air purifiers or humidifiers are so loud, you can't hear anything. Oh, look at that boga right over there. That's something else. See, that's just because it's Florida. Florida's got a lot of them. I don't know if you guys remember I did a B-roll of him, and it was actually one of my favorite B-roll shots. I don't know, I just, it looked like something from a movie. Is Larry there? Oh, this is actually where I met Larry. Larry the, the raccoon. It was right around here. You could see, wow, look at that. You can see the mold. Here, I'm gonna show it to you guys. You can see the spider webs. Mold building up. Huh. I didn't see that before. What is that? Like bugs?
Random Nautica does give coordinates. I've been thinking about doing Random Nautica. I wanted to do it at a at a special location. Like, uh, I guess if I ever tried to do that app, I would do it in a good, like a really good place. I was thinking maybe uh, Utah and Skinwalker Ranch and then seeing what that has to offer. Here, let me put my light back on my head. Made it live, yes. Hi everyone. There we go. Sitting out there. So yeah, I was thinking if I ever do that, I want to do it at a place that already has good content in case nothing happens about it. Because the last thing I want to do is show up at a location and waste time. I don't know if it works or not. So look at this. This is, I, I think I saw a comment here. Went, oh, look, my mom's here. Hey, mom. Are you back home? <laughs> Sorry. It's my madre. Mr. Ireland, my coordinates are to a haunted building in Portland or I know where the forest is there not long ago. Mr. Ireland. Okay, so do this. Send me those coordinates on Instagram and I will visit them on a, on a day that no one knows if I ever get around that area. But I definitely want to look at it on Google Maps and get a feel for it. I'll probably be in here for a little bit see if see what happens. Play it by ear. My coordinates are drawn. Would you mind giving me five my five year old son Callan a shout out? It would make his world. Uh, he loves watching you with me. Callan! Shout out to you, buddy. I know Callan, you're the man. You're the man. And always go to school, Callan. Uh, I'll also be looking for ghosts. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Good luck, Callan. Uh, let me see. Ah, uh, there she is. Franco, I love you. I love you too, Shelby. I'm going to go back to the front here because I'll be stuck in the comments forever into the deep end. Okay, there we go. So let's talk about updates. I'm going to be walking around here doing my, because I like to walk and talk for some reason. I'm like on an exercise uh, binge right now, so I'm just, <laughs> I could walk forever. So what I want to do is, I guess, right when fall starts hitting, which should be around next month-ish, kind of, I'm going to start making my way out of Florida, start hitting up all the locations. Now, some places closed down due to COVID, but no need to fear because what I want to do is I want to see if I can make myself go to overseas place. Now goes to the part where I've been keeping my promises. I've been wanting to give you guys the creepiest locations and that's what I'm going to do. Um, I guess I'm going to be going overseas. I'm going to do a test, a test location, seeing how well I can survive there. Um, and then going over to, now the thing is that I might lower on quality. I don't know, I don't wanna say that, but it only depends on the locations that I'm going. Because if I go to a dangerous location, which they're everywhere, I run the potential of getting robbed and all my stuff getting taken away or worse, kidnapped and then put for ransom. And I know no one's gonna try to, yeah. So. <laughs> Good luck trying to, anyway, so <clears throat> let me see if I could do a, a test location, seeing how well I do there. And then after that, uh, go further in. I am dying, like I'm literally, I've always craved and wanted, and I might have a connection with a guy named Nikolov, okay? Nikolov is the man. You don't mess with Nikolov. Nikolov messes with you, okay? He has a connection that maybe I could get in to Pripyat, Pripyat, where Pripyat, Pripyat in Parvel, not Parvelov, that's a video game, uh, Chernobyl, Chernobyl, where the whole nuclear power plant radiation thing kind of got affected. I'll have to go with a glycometer or something, or a equal, what do you call that, that, that monitors radiation? Nikol of Russia, he's the man, trust me. I'll fit in in Russia, trust me, I'll pull it off. But yeah, like, something like that. Uh, you, I know somebody on here knows what it's called. But um, yeah, so love, love from Portugal. Thank you, Johnny. I appreciate it. Uh, towards your 
lead collection, stay strapped. Thank you. Oh my God. Yeah, that's another thing. I could carry a weapon from state to state, thanks to Sean. Sean pointed that out for me. Um, <clears throat> however, I may not be able to, well, probably I could, but to a foreign country with a weapon, I don't know. Haven't done the research on that. But Nikolov has got me covered. I don't have to worry about him because he'll have my back. He'll protect me. Um, Barb T, thank you so much. Um, and that's only for when I get to, uh, I guess, Pripyat, if that happens. I'm hoping everything looks good. Then, Suicide Forest. I, I'm not going to record, I'm not going to pull Logan Paul or anything stupid, but <clears throat> I do want to go in to Suicide Forest, and I know it's one hell of an adventure to getting deep inside there. But apparently, that place is creepy at night. I've seen some live streams where a guy walked through there. Yeah, so that's another one I want to do. I'm talking about hitting the best ones for the creepiest locations. Hopefully the humidity is a lot lower than what I'm expecting. Come to Arizona at Memory Lawn Cemetery. It's very weird, haunted, I promise. I'll look into it. I love cemeteries. Cemeteries are little things that I can do while I'm looking for the big locations. Uh, and I miss it. I miss it like crazy. Exploring with Josh did a video at Chernobyl two or three years ago. Okay, so Exploring with Josh, <clears throat> he's the man. I think... <laughs> Josh is one of the people that got me motivated on adventuring because I'm like, oh my God, these places exist. And so, uh, yeah, I want to do it, but adding my whole creepy thing to it. You know what I mean? Like putting the creepy intro with the ambience and you know how I do it. So I really want to, I Frankify it, I guess. I don't know. Uh, come to Texas. Texas is a place that I will be going to. Um, and then, yeah. And then seeing how that works. I'm, I'm excited for it. you guys see too. That was weird. I heard like a footstep. The audio on this is not as good as my other cameras, but yeah, I'm not doing a video here. This is just a place that I went to so I could give you guys a cool location um, that I wanted to go to. Um, so <clears throat> yes, and then I had some People ask me, are you going to go to Ed Gein's place or Ed Gein's house? Ed Gein no longer has a house. They torn the house down because of all the dead bodies that they found inside the house. So it no longer exists. And I think they moved his, his grave site to another grave site, if I'm right. I could be wrong. But I could visit the grave site, I guess. Something-ish. Uh, I'd love to see what a CU adventure in Louisiana swamps actually i was in louisiana i might make another adventure out there because that's on my way to texas and louisiana has the best graveyards you could possibly see franco what's up tim young uh take hyro as as bait hyro will always be the virgin sacrifice uh he's called it i'm gonna get him a shirt that says the virgin sacrifice uh i'm just kidding i love you hyro if you're watching hyro's the man um i'm trying to see if i could do another reaction video before I leave not this next one the next one I got a really good full-fledged video for you guys working on another kind of reaction videos what do you guys want to see as far as reaction wise because I'm kind of new to that and I don't know I want to make it fun and interesting especially since I'm in the place of where Hyro's at so sacrificial version equals Hyro. <laughs> he's gonna kill me for that oh my god I love Hyro Get Hyro, he jumps. Hyro makes me jump because he freaks me out because he'll, he screams so loud sometimes, so it freaks me out. Um, but yeah, uh, Hyro is the, the sacrificial lamb. <laughs> I'm trying, oh, so I did get Hyro. Hyro is down to go with me overseas. So if he could come with me overseas, that would be even better. Please come to West Michigan. Uh, being by so much water, we have so much paranormal activity, also UFOs. You got me on the UFO part. I am so interested in the UFOs, too. Um, I want to get some... I don't know. I, I, I want to... Just when you have to start looking for infrared, things get expensive. But I do have an, a thermal imaging camera and a night vision, which is freaking phenomenal. Uh, welcome to Sweden, to Bug Vervet. 
Well, who was talking? I think it was PewDiePie was saying something about Sweden, that you guys have sweets or something like that. I don't know. Some Cryptid Adventures 2. Uh, Nukes Type 5 is cool. Nukes Type 5 is awesome. I want to see Frank on Magic Mushrooms. Jesus, that might be the last you see of me. Um, I might get arrested for that one. <laughs> Magic Mushrooms. Holy crap. I'll be seeing things like, look, guys, look. it's a, look, There it is. And you guys don't see anything, but it's all me. I need more of Franco. I like nukes. Oh, I, I love nukes. Um, the Underground Mall. Oh, wait, what? The Underground Mall? Sorry, that was me. The Underground Mall now forgot. It is too dangerous. I'd love too much to let you go into that. I will do it. I like abandoned malls, especially underground malls. Uh, I think you need a 360 cam. I don't know. I, I get a lot of mixed feelings with 360 cams because that I heard. I get a lot of weird things with 360 cams. Should I just like shut up and so that way you guys could hear? I'm not going to talk. Come on, do it again. Can you do it again? Damn it. I don't know if you guys heard that. It was very faint. Let's actually walk up there. So, yeah, I get, I, I don't think a lot of people like the 360 cameras too much. I mean, I would use it. I don't know. I, I, I want, I want like, I don't know. It, it depends. You guys will let me know. I could use it. Or have videos where I do use it. This is what I heard. Oh shit, that actually scared me for a second. Okay. door just came off the hinge. All right, I won't touch that. you guys right here. I'm not going to touch the phone for a second. Come on, stay up. This little pod is going like the swivel is super loose. I just want you guys to see if you hear what I'm hearing. Because I heard it again right after I was kind of coming out of the door, but did anyone else see why? I've heard of skinwalkers in Mexico or New Mexico. Hello?
See, I kind of wish I had my other camera right now. Um, so I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Do you guys want to stay in here or you guys want to go outside? Or you know what? I should get the K2. Let's get the K2 out. But I'm going to have to go outside. How much battery do I have? 40%. I think we should be good. Let's go up here. Hey, Franco. Cal, always watching. Stay safe. Thank you, Linda. Go outside. Go outside. All right, I'll go outside. If you see me turn off my light, is because I don't want my flashlight hitting the main road. People get suspicious out here. Alright. Get Boo Bear. Be careful, those things can come after you. I've witnessed deep people coming out of their crypts in suits and ties. What? You've witnessed that? I think I've heard of stories like that in like Nigeria where they weren't properly uh, diagnosed as, as like they died and uh, and yeah they were actually still alive yeah they weren't they were still alive and uh, they woke up in the middle of their casket and then you'll see claw marks and stuff. And that's because they were they 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 didn't they weren't buried properly or say they didn't die on time. Or what am I talking about? They were misproperly diagnosed as dead when they weren't. They were like in a coma state. Hello from Greenland. Thank you, Carl Peter. Ah uh, No, it is time. It no, it was a time capsule. Well now I'm lost. All right, give me a second. I'm gonna grab my uh, my K2. Now I have, I literally just shine my light on all the cars. Now I have this one, I don't know where my other K2 is, and I didn't mean to turn it on. Alright, when Frank walked out of the door, yeah that's exactly where I'm going to go, uh, Chris. This is where I heard the tapping. All right. A 
let us go and say we did. Hold on, I'm gonna have my light off for a second. Damn, you guys are right up in my nose. There we go. Yo, Frank, my family and I are huge fans. My girlfriend and I are in Orlando and almost went to, <laughs> to investigate. Got any location suggestions? Um, I would keep the locations private. Try to keep them to yourselves. Not everybody has the best intentions and that is the best advice that I could tell you. Um, but yeah, just, yeah, just do that. Um, let's go up through here. Yeah, when you guys find beautiful places, you guys gotta be very careful about who you say it to because they, people ruin it for other people and next thing you know, they lock these places down because there's just that one person that had to do something that they weren't supposed to do. And so that's why I always keep a lot of my places private. I, I take care of these places like if they're my home and I have such a high amount of respect for them. All right. This should be interesting. There was a cough. Was it me? Because I cough a lot. In fact, every time I edit a video, it's because I'm coughing. <laughs> A lot of the times. All right. There we go. I agree. Yeah. Thank you, Michelle. Yeah, you have to. There we go. Oh, no worries, X, 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 I cannot say that. I'm going to call you X. <laughs> no worries, X. It's all good. Question about 401, anyone planned? Oh, for missing 401, Tennessee? Hell yeah. Oh, my God, heck yes. Um, the only reason why I couldn't do so much in, I think, where was it? Oregon. Oh, no. I didn't make it to the National Park. And, damn, did I forget or something? Something happened. I'm gonna kind of keep my voice low because I'm. I don't know what I'm hearing. Four on one. I'll see if I'll do a four on one video. Remember, everything is up for. Uh, everything should happen. Born abandoned mines? Of course I would do. I've done mines before. I went to Area 51, and there's so many mines that are hidden out there, but if you guys ever go, be extremely careful. All right. That's me. That's me. I don't know if you guys can hear it. That's my phone causing that. Let's see if it's gonna... I just turned off. All right. You ready? Three... Two, one. If you'd like to get close to me, talk to me. Just give me any sign that you're here with me. I would appreciate it. My name is Frank. I do have a couple of other people here watching. Open for communication. That's me. Hold on. So I'm trying to manage the phone. There we go. I don't know if I should call this a K2 or a milligauze 50 to 60 hertz. Let's put it right here. Ooh.
Can you come close to me? Hello? I hate saying hello. I sound like Michael Jackson every time I say it. Oh, it's doing that. It's getting something. Can you come closer? My name is Frank. I don't want to talk. I, I hate talking like that. I sound like I'm talking like I'm talking to a kid. Hello. My name is Frank. <laughs> it's so much weirder doing it live. Um, what if they're Hispanic? Hello. Me llamas Frank. I'm getting something too. Look at it. It's jumping. Uh, tu quieres hablar conmigo? Yo soy un caballero. <laughs> no, me not. <laughs> I'm going to start getting comments. You need to translate it in English. Tu puedes hablar conmigo? I mean, oh, what am I doing? I'm still talking. Sp Do you want to talk to me? Is there something you want to say, do, or wondering why I'm even here? Yes, this is the same place. Ooh, I got a jump there. Look, I got a little bit of a jump. Do it again. Oh, look, look, did you see that? It jumped. So happy I finally caught you live, man. Been lurking since you started the vids, man. Keep it. Thank you so much. Can you come closer again to me? I could totally use the attention. I haven't had so much in a long, uh, so much attention in a long time. I want to be careful how I word this, because this could go south very quickly. Um, is your name Angelo? Or Vince? I'm only saying Angelo or Vincent because I'm reading the tombs. Just in case. Oh, no. It turned off. There we go. Hello? Roberto? You got to say... Oh, oh, I got it. Look at it. It's going. Roberto. Oh, what kind of new... Oh, dang it. I got to move the phone for that. Hold on. I got to see that. What kind of new night vision setup do you have now? It's really great. Thank you. I actually got a very strong IR light. Roberto? And the, the IR light. You see how it jumps? I want to get that one jump. There's just one place that I go to that this thing goes crazy. I got to show it to you guys. I want to do it live, too, so you guys can see it. Come on. Stay focused. Susie? Mr. Boyer? Hello? Look, at, look, look. I get the weird spikes. All right, I'm going to put this right here. I'm not even going to touch it. Oh. Larry? <laughs> I got something. It's up. Oh, it just went away. Oh, wow, we do have 1K views. That's awesome. I didn't even know. Oh, that's way too bright. There we go. You can come close to me. I'm literally friendly. All I do is walk around, ask questions, and if I'm lucky, you're willing to respond or you're trying to respond and I get lucky on hearing it. Come on. Can you get... Can you get a little bit closer to me? I know it's going to sound awkward me asking you that. But a little bit more closer than you would. Ooh. A little bit more closer than you would uh, without feeling awkward. Like we're best friend. There you go. Come on. Wow, that's pretty cool. 
Um, my name is Frank. Now that we're pretty close, I, I couldn't say I come here often. I'm not sure if you do. Can you keep getting closer? Come on, get closer. Hello? I don't want to lose you. Stay in contact with me. There we are. I'll keep it interesting. I'll act like a human. I'll be as completely normal as I can. Mi nombre es esta Frank, which also means my name is Frank. I'm usually here on the weekdays. I try to have a day off on the weekends. Are you okay with me being here? The only way to respond to that is by getting closer. Like if we're... God, another noise. Like if we're friends. I might have... You can still follow me. You can still follow me. Is there something you... I'm going to get you guys involved in this too. Let's go with... Is there something you want to say to Brayden? Hiro is the virgin sacrifice. What do you think about... No, let me not say that. That would be so awesome. Um, that would be... Uh, I heard the whisper, I think. Tamara says there was a whisper. Did you whisper? And I didn't hear it? Oh, it's off. This thing shuts off by itself. Oh, there we go. My battery was dying. Why drag me into this man? Oh, Brayden. Okay, I'm sorry, Brayden. Uh, Brayden wants nothing to do. He He's sorry. Uh, we will go with the next uh, runner-up. We will go with... <laughs> Brayden, it's funny because your name keeps popping up. Jessica. Jessica wants to know, heard the whispers too. You think you could whisper again? Or whisper to this little gray device? I can see you trying. How about... It looks like it's trying. Look at that. Look at that. It's like pushing. I want to get it past a four or five. Man, I wish I could take you guys to the other graveyard. I should have taken you guys there. There's a place there where it's called... Uh, it's actually where they, oh, well, you know, I, th I showed it on a video. They actually bury children there. But once you go in there, this box goes crazy. Oh, no, Franco, shut up. All right, I'll shut up. It is pretty old school. Dang it. I lost it. I'm going to put it right here. go literally you hear it it's like it's pushing all right it's dope i like this thing this thing actually is really cool but sometimes you go to really cool locations and it gets really cool i wish i had the other one i don't know what happened to my other k2 you guys want to go for a walk outside and seeing how well it does up there? Oh, freaking A. Stupid chair scared the hell out of me. I thought somebody was like, <laughs> I thought somebody was huddled there for a second. I'm like, no, buddy, don't you dare do it. I thought I was about to get scared. All right, let's go outside. All right. Let's see how this K2 reacts at the area where we saw the mist. Come on, focus. 
Franco, such a big fan. Oh, thanks, Mark. All right. Let's go this way. Don't worry, Mio. It's just the chair. No, I know. But sometimes with the corner of your eye, it looks like something else. And it freaks you out. Oh, I got this headache. Okay, I don't know if you guys can hear it. This thing just beeped. I haven't even got there yet. I am so done with getting freaked out. I thought there was somebody wrapped up in something white. Moving forward. Here we go. All right. Let me dim down the light so that way this thing doesn't. There we go. It just looks so bright. I'm back. I was here before and I saw something on camera. I was hoping you could do it again for me. Let's play a game. We like games. Let's play truth or dare. I'll go first. I'll go with dare. What would you like me to do? I want to get down and dirty with you. And I like how when I say that, the thing starts going off a little bit. <laughs> Definitely not doing that. That's a very spiritual thing. I almost sound like Biden. That's a very spiritual thing. Getting down and dirty with a ghost or something from another world. I remember, oh, let me stop. I'm, I'm, I'm going too far into it. I gotta keep it professional. You gotta understand, I'm only human, so sometimes my brain drifts and my other side comes out and I get a little bit too carried away. Franco, do you have your angel box with you? No, I do not. things make it some weird I worked at cemeteries for years I can tell you whatever you want to know I've seen some weird that was a Muddy's car radio all right I'm gonna get closer you just have to promise to be nice and just come a little bit close to the box so I could receive some sort of contact that's all I want I just want just a little bit of contact I've ran out to people to talk to, and so I'm here looking for you again. Can you be so kind to do me that favor? I'm willing to do the dare if you if you if you're willing to do it. All right. This part edges me out a little bit. Just to help support you, dear. Oh, thank you, Cher. You didn't have to stop it. You don't have to do that. <laughs> I appreciate it, though. Franco, you have to remember to forget what to say if you are going to imitate, uh, if I'm going to imitate who? Imitate Joe Biden. I didn't say anything politician. I'm just imitating their accents. I'm not getting into politics. I don't do that. I just, I already know what down, I'm not, I don't know enough. I'm not even trying to. Moving forward. Let's get back into what we're doing. Could you come? No, let me stop. I'm not going to do Joe Biden while doing this. Uh, let's, uh, I agree, Franco. Franco. <laughs> oh. Those balloons just moved. Probably because of wind. We could do Michael Jackson. 
so we don't get it politics. Uh, let's do Michael Jackson. Ghost hunting with Michael Jackson. Here we go. I just want to start off with saying happy birthday. <clears throat> I mean, happy birthday. I meant happy Friday. It's It hasn't been a Friday in a long time. And I was hoping maybe you could come close so I could pick you up in my K2 with this little milligoss. That would be so nice and I wouldn't have to feel so ignorant. Come on, get a little closer. Just let me get one spike. That would mean the world. <laughs> uh, oh, it's I'm, I'm such an idiot. The thing turned off on me. I'm like, damn, I'm getting nothing. That's me. I don't know what this button does, but if you press it, it just like does this weird thing. But that's totally me. Going back to uh, what I was doing. <clears throat> Another day is gone. I'm still all alone. You know you want to be. I, I, I love that song. I used to listen to that song all the time. Oh, that's sad. I don't want to look at that. All right, let's keep going. Um, a lonely boy like me. Let's try, uh, let's see. What's another one? What's another one we can do? Let's go this way. This is where we're going to go to a darker area. Hoping I get something. If not, I might have to finish this off in, in the mausoleum. If I don't get some sort of action here. See, this is part of it. This is what happens. Sometimes you get nothing for a while and then you get those random spikes all right what was that oh that was me i pressed the button <clears throat> i think someone said do pennywise hello <laughs> you want to get close nah, i don't know i gotta i get nervous with pennywise you gotta do him right or don't do him at all you only sing when you're nervous, Frank. I do. I, especially around these areas. Maybe if I turn off the lights and I go dark. All right. That's it. I'm in the shit now. Here's some money to go towards. Thank you, Tamara. I appreciate it. Hello? Oh my god, I still sound like Michael. Hello. It is dark. It's dark as balls. Let's go with some light. Okay. I did it. There's this one area I want to try here first. Right over inside of here. Oh, my shoulder's giving out. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Look at that. So this next video that I'm about to show you guys on Monday happened in the beginning of a, of a thunderstorm. So I got all the lightning on camera. It looks so dope. All right. Well, this would be it here. Okay. I'm gonna press it once. Don't make me look bad. Here we go. Hola, Franco. Do Dracula. <laughs> One, two, three, four. All right. Can you come close to the <laughs> Do Dracula? I think of Sesame Street. Frank, how are you? I almost missed your live stream. Oh, welcome in. You made it. Um, doing good so far. A little bit of a headache that's coming out of nowhere, but I'm doing good so far. We're doing like a K2 session. Hoping I could get some luck. Um, all right, so let's do it. If you want to talk to me, <laughs> come close to the, to the, to the, to the Kate, uh, I don't know, I'm going to call it Milagos, to the Milagos. Don't be afraid, dude, Big Bird. <laughs> or chills. We'll do chills doing ghost hunting. <clears throat> I haven't done chills in a while, so I guess it's fair to, now it would probably be appropriate. 
All right. Don't say anything you could get in trouble with, Frank. Just keep it cool. I was wondering if you could come close to the K2. That will be great. <laughs> if I could just spike at number four, I would really much appreciate it. <laughs> A group of urban explorers was exploring an abandoned graveyard. But little did they know that they were being watched or followed. If you're interested in how I look like, you could watch me on Dylan is Chillin' on IG. <laughs> that was the old chills. The old chills, he used, to, he used to do that. And then he came out with the songs, which is freaking brilliant. That's me, I'm pressing the button. But little did Frank realize that he was not there alone. Consider it wishful thinking, because he could probably use a jump scare right about now. Stupid leaves. Frank, I love your videos. Oh wait, I'm sorry. I'm reading it in, well, I'll probably. Frank, Joanne Hearings, Yep, stupid, stupid, stupid. I don't know if there's an animal or the trees just moved. Or probably wind. I'm going to assume it's wind or an animal. It could be Larry. Going back. Uh... Can you do it again so I could pay attention? It is the, see? Do it again. I would like you to do it again. I would appreciate it. I remember of a story when I was a little boy. I would go to the store to grab some food and all kinds of cool stuff with a bike and there was a snail and a mushroom. And the snail always wanted the mushroom. So he rode a bike. <laughs> I'm done, I'm sorry. I'm not doing Biden no more. I just realized I could kind of do his voice just a little bit, but I'm done. Um, all right. That freaked me out for a second. I thought it was, I thought it was. Maybe it was, it could have been. I'll leave it up to you guys. Because I'm not an expert. Uh, let's do it here. Oh, come on, Frank. That that was only wind. No, I think it was wind, but the thing is, when you hear leaves shuffling out of you, I thought something was going to jump out or jump on top of me, which would probably be the most action I've gotten in years. Even by a gecko. All right. Going back to stage four. Now, you guys let me know if you want me to go back into the mausoleum. Um, no, no, let's not talk about Biden. Stop it. I was only kidding. Um, I'm going <laughs> to, I'm going to do one more session here. And if I'm lucky, just maybe this thing could go crazy. If not, I'm going to owe it to you guys. I'm going to take you guys to a place where I know this thing goes crazy yet. You're going to love it. Franco, is that a goat? <laughs> I don't know what that means. You got Franco. No politics, guys. Yeah, no politics. Please, no politics. I was only joking. I was doing an accent, an impersonation. Pretty dead on. But, all right. No po <laughs> Hey, Franco. All right. All right, I give up. That was interesting. But let's go back into the tomb or into the mausoleum. And I will finish it up there, or wrap things up. I'm kind of lost, actually. Is it this way? And then I make a right, oh, and my battery's like at 15%. He should do a Vincent Price voice. Oh, Vincent Price. 
That name sounds so freaking familiar. I don't remember who Vincent Price is. On the next live, I'll do it. I'll totally do it. Because I can't do it on the... What do you call it? On the... I cannot do it on the actual videos. Because I don't want to, like, distract from, you know, the location. Oh, a freaking bunny. Maybe that's what I was hearing, was a bunny. The most threatening things on the face of this earth is a bunny. I'm just kidding. Their eyes are creepy, though. Goodbye, fella. Run free with your family. Don't let no one judge you. Don't let your dreams be dreams. All right, let's go inside here. Then I'm going to head out and give you guys one hell of a video tomorrow, Monday. Monday is the day. There you go. Vincent Price narrated Thriller. Oh, Vincent Price. First time catching you live. Love your content. Wacky Jackie. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, hi from Jersey. Daddy. Oh, what a name. I should have named my channel that, Daddy. No, I'm kidding. I, I wouldn't. But I like the name, though. Frank White, uh, don't you back to Jacksonville Cemetery location where you captured the entity in the tomb and nukes top five talk. Okay, that's a good, good question. Let's talk about that. Uh, the reason why is because I don't think I'm allowed back. I made the crucial mistake, and this is why I tell everybody, do not say the names of the locations you go to because it's not always good for the people that work there or for, you know, and so my genius self, I, I wasn't anywhere where I'm at now, I, I'm literally nowhere, but I didn't think people were gonna start going to these locations. Well, that's what happened. They started going to that location and it, it didn't turn out well. And yeah, and I went back one time and it wasn't the prettiest thing in the world. And so that's why I haven't been back. I don't wanna piss people off. I'm literally just trying to just mind my own business, doing a video and then I get out. But that's why I haven't been back. Maybe I'll do a live stream and I go back there. Because uh, I know they'll be happy during the daytime, but at night they won't let me because the gate's closed. It's closed at night, so they won't let me do it. Um, but, yeah, that's pretty much how that turned out. Um, the other thing I wanted to tell you guys is get ready because I am releasing another grandma video. But I'm going to leave it to you guys because this video is going to be pretty awesome. You guys are going to like it. I heard something pretty creepy. And I'm just leaving, and I found something. I found something there that I didn't even know was there. Like, it's in the other, I'm not even going to say it. I'll leave it to you guys so you guys can see it. Um, there's someone behind you. I have a two-way screen. I can see. Imagine you see, like, a child. Uh, just a little kid just kind of staring at you. That would be creepy. The living comes with grassy tread to re try to read the gravestones on the hill. The graveyard draws the living stuff, but never be any more the dead. Um, Yasmin Basello, Yasmin Basello, we are we are out ghost hunting as you are live, looking for Gordon Light in Gordon, Arkansas. I heard Gordon. Wait, maybe I'm thinking of Gordon Ramsay. That's the chef guy. But I did hear about the lights in the railroad tracks where it was like super creepy or whatever. And if you shine a light, then you see a responding light. I never found that location, but if that's where you're at, you better post that, Jasmine. Those things are awesome. That video is awesome, or those people. There's also another house that I, I heard of called, uh, I don't remember the name. Um, but yeah, keep it up. I, I, I cannot wait to get out there. I'm so tired of Florida. Nothing against Florida. I'm just, I don't like Florida to be honest. All the good stuff I've seen is out there. There's good stuff here, but I just seen so much amazing places out there as well. Don't forget to take Hyro with you at Area 51. Well, I have to go by Hyro's schedule. He has a full-time job. Uh, he's no longer doing truck driving. He does something else. I don't want to see it because I don't know if he wants me to throw that information out there. It's just privacy. But yeah, Hyro is doing something else, but I'll have to see if he is down to doing so. Um, but I do want to get him to go out of the country with me, at least for my safety until I get used to it. When I saw her just sitting there in the dark, staring at the grave, two and two didn't add up. Probably talking about a ghost video. Frank, say hi to Phyllis. 
hi, Phyllis. I don't know if Phyllis on your end, or do I know somebody named Phyllis? And you wanted me to say hi for them to you. I don't know, but if it's the other way, hi, Phyllis. <laughs> Franco, what's going on, Doom Dude Max? Um, all right, guys, so at this point, I have been live for about an hour and 15 minutes. I do have something going on at home that I have to check up with my family about, make sure everything's doing good. I hope you guys like this video. I want to take you guys to another place where I do know where the K2 meter goes berserk. I did show it on video, but I want to take you guys there live so you guys can see it. It's actually pretty cool. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. I missed you. Thank you guys for coming here. Stay tuned till Monday. I got one hell of a video coming out on Monday. I can't wait for you guys to see it. And I'm using new cameras and stuff. I think the day after that, I'm going to start working on a new program, which I could even up in the resolution and the quality on the videos to a much higher rate. I love you. And till then, be safe, stay surviving, and beautiful stuff like that. I don't even, I'm going to stop while I'm ahead because I'm digging my own grave. No pun intended. Moving forward. Love you guys. Be safe. And I will see you in the next video. This is the awkward part because now I have to exit out.